No such thing as a free lunch? Rubbish. I'm going to show you the best free software that'll bring you to the next level as a musician. So you got to keep watching. Before we start, if you do like the video, do click the like button. And why not subscribe to Adorama Music to get notifications of more amazing content. If there's anything you want to ask about music, podcasting or audio production, put them in the comments below. I will get back to you. Free software is something that I'll be addressing again and again and again. Because I want to bring you more stuff to help you in your creativity and your production workflow. What we'll talk about today are a few packages that are free versions of DAWs. What is a DAW? Well, a DAW is a digital audio workstation. What's that? Well, it's software that helps you record, edit and mix sound. You can also work with a thing called MIDI, but we'll look at that again. You may have heard of Cubase or Pro Tools. They're DAWs. There's a lot to learn about DAWs and how to use them for making your music. It can be very daunting, but don't worry, the rewards will be great. And there's always help with asking me the questions in the comments or other less informed YouTube videos. There are some DAWs that come free with certain products like Cubase LE with Zoom products and Pro Tools First with Focusrite products. And then there are others that you can just download like Studio One, Waveform or Soundbridge. I want to introduce you to just a couple today and I'll bring you more in the coming months. Firstly, Cubase LE. Cubase is the cornerstone of music production around the world. So starting with a professional platform is a big step up from the beginning. When you progress and move into studios, then the systems they're using will not be as daunting for you if you're familiar with the workings. Cubase ships with Zoom products, along with other software like Wavelab and Wavelab Cast. All you have to do is download the installer and put in the code that's in the Zoom products box. And now you're away. Cubase LE is a serious package for music production as it comes with lots of plugins that are things like reverbs, effects, virtual instruments and drum loops that'll get you started and allow you to develop to a really high level very quickly. There are lots of functions that are drag and drop, which is a huge help for anyone starting out. Everything you may need like instruments, drum loops and effects are all in the media bay section. Just drag and drop what you need onto your timeline. And before you know it, you have the makings of a quality arrangement. First things first, hit the F4 key on your keyboard and tell it what audio hardware you want to use for the input and the output. The output is whatever your speakers are attached to and the input is where you plug in your microphone or your instrument. Have a look at how to choose an audio interface show in the Perfecting Audio playlist on Adorama to give you help with getting audio in and out of a computer. Create a new audio track. Click the little round record button and speak into your mic or strum your guitar. If you're not hearing yourself, then put the track into monitor mode with a little speaker icon. You should now hear yourself. Hit the record button and make some noise. Hit the space bar and stop recording and then the space bar again to play back what you just recorded. These functions are common to most DAWs. Now, set up another track, put it into record, but don't forget to turn off the record button on the first track. Now build up a few tracks and start playing. Remember, all the men out there to read the manual. It'll help you much pain and suffering. Cubase LE has some limitations, but it's perfect to get you started on the long road to perfection. Another professional platform that I wanted to show you is Pro Tools First. The reason I mention it again is because it's a professional standard. So going forward, it's good to have a working knowledge of it. 
As for working with it, it is very limited in its functionality. And whilst it could be good for putting down a vocal track and a couple of tracks of guitar, its limitations are too limiting. You will find you need to progress to the paid versions pretty quickly. Download it, install it, see how you get on, enough said. A really great option for their first DAWs, Studio One Prime from Presonus. You can download it free from their site and start immediately. The reason I mention this DAW is because a lot of the functions are drag and drop, which will suit a lot of people starting out. And that'll help them get song ideas and arrangements down quickly. It installs with virtual instruments and effects that are quite good. And because of the drag and drop nature, are easy to set up. No, it's not a professional grade DAW, and you won't find it in many studios around the world, but you will be writing and arranging in a very short time. We'll continue to look at more software for your music creation in other shows. If you have any questions on this show or want to see a show on other music or audio related stuff, ask me in the comments below. I'm Keith Alexander and you've been watching the Adorama Music Channel. Don't forget to subscribe to Adorama Music for more great videos. We'd love for you to like, comment, even share this video. And tune in next time to discover more, learn more, and improve more.